Minister for Finance, Mohammed Aurangzeb, Dr. Anita Jaidi, President Bill and, Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, Federal Ministers, Governor State Bank, Jamil Ahmed, Vakasul Hassan of Karandas, Excellencies, Federal Ministers, Ladies and Gentlemen, Assalamu Alaikum. It's really a great honor and a pleasure to be here this evening for this uh, uh, connectivity between uh, Buna Rast, which is actually a great uh, connectivity between Pakistan and Arab world. It's a matter of uh, great comfort and happiness. This will certainly uh, a great uh, step forward in promoting our financial transaction through modern techniques. In that, uh, I would like to uh, appreciate uh, Your Excellency, your contribution, and uh, Melinda Bill Gates Foundation, and of course, uh, Karan Das, you have been extremely helpful in the recent months. I'm sure this project is also going to be uh, very, very productive in our efforts. And uh, Minister Aurangzeb, Governor State Bank, all of you have done a remarkable job. But let me first make a couple of corrections. Uh, Karandas, CEO said, completion time would be five years. Actually, he made a, uh, you know, a mistake. It was five months, in fact. <laughs> so I'm sure he's going to uh, make this uh, correction uh, sooner rather than later. And there was another, uh, you know, mistake made by me. And I'm thankful to His Excellency. He made this correction. I thought uh, uh, Buna comes from Bunni. And he said, no, it's not Bunni. It comes from Banaya. Uh, that is building. So thank you very much. But uh, Banaya, Laisa min Hadid, Lakin min Falus Yani. Hada Nukta Mohima Jaddin. So uh, I would like to say, make a very short statement. And that is, uh, uh, you know, launching of this Bunarast connectivity project uh, as a matter of uh, a great, uh, you know, happiness for all of us. Uh, it is significant because it is going to expand the reach of Pakistan's digital payment infrastructure. Today, our country enters into a new dimension of digital governance by integrating Pakistan into the broader financial ecosystem and formalizing remittance flows. This groundbreaking initiative will further strengthen our historical relations with the Arab world in a modern digital way. This landmark initiative aims to facilitate our fellow Pakistanis living abroad and ensure that their efforts translate seamlessly as well as timely into support for their families back home in Pakistan. Ladies and gentlemen, Bunarast signifies how 21st century Pakistan is moving ahead with augmenting modern technology into people's lives. I am happy that this beginning is happening at a time when the country is celebrating its 77 years of independence, hard-earned independence. It is Pakistan's first cross-border real-time payment systems linkage that will make remittances more affordable and accessible. Additionally, it also holds the potential to accelerate our connectivity into a future model of wider payment connectivity where transaction will take place region 
to region cross border retail payments and remittances between the arab region and pakistan amounts to over us dollar 20 billion annually i would like to extend my warmest congratulations to arab monetary fund dr fadil turki and of course state bank of pakistan mr jamil ahmed as well as minister of finance karan das and many other stakeholders who are involved in this wonderful program let us work together to harness the power of finance and technology as a force for good and become better and stronger together finance minister has made certain remarks in his uh, speech i wouldn't want to add anything on top of that uh, what he said about our economy it is on the improve but still we are facing humongous challenges inshallah through our joint efforts and teamwork we will inshallah reach our destination one day soon a few challenges which uh, make my uh, job uh, most definitely challenging is the uh, federal board of revenue which is now undergoing huge transformation i am personally supervising this fantastic uh, digitization program again through the good offices of uh, melinda bill gates foundation and karan das they have offered uh, financial support for this program and mckinsey is uh, our consultants uh, we have seen in the past uh, such consultants being engaged for decades but nothing happened but this time around it will happen and happen uh, quicker than all of you can imagine inshallah second challenge is our power sector and that is again uh, a great challenge we are dealing with it uh, like never before inshallah we will show results through team efforts in coming weeks and months our program is under discussion and uh, i will announce this program very soon it's called uh, home grown economic program great work has gone into it uh, great uh, discussions deliberations all stakeholders have been involved for the last many months and uh, recently we have been able to find light its broad uh, parameters in the next week or so we will finalize it and i will go to the people and announce this program uh, which will uh, be our uh, program for the next 5 years as to how to improve our economy our agriculture it and of course uh, all those areas hitherto untapped there is no magic wand it's all about hard work sacrifice blood and sweat i think our nation is very robust and strong nation our people are very brave people full of vigor and full of hope and full of energy finally i would say that uh, let's put our act together all these reforms have started taking place let's not waste time on debates which we have had in the past let's now use this time for actual implementation on the ground inshallah you will see we will have dividends uh, for this great country and we will find our place in the community of nations through hard work hard work and hard work pakistan find the bar